Hey guys, Kevin at GloveRelace.com and today we have something a little different. I uh, had this glove sent to me in request for a full relace and as it sits is how I received it, all lace removed. But the one problem we have here is that we're going to have to put in a brand new web because the original web is busted. But that's not an issue here. What I have here is a, a stock web that I, I like to keep. I use this on a lot of catcher's gloves. Now it's not exactly the same, but um, I'll make it work. And I'm in the process right now of darkening this guy to get closer to this color so it all looks looks pretty good. But uh, if you don't mind, bear with me one quick second. You will see the after shot of this full relace in black lace Wilson A. 201791 Pudge Pro Stock Catcher's Mitt, and I will give it a good clean, a few conditions, and get this thing back out in the field. So uh, bear with me one quick second, you will see the after shot, and if you have any questions, feel free to contact me through my website at www.gloverelace.com. Thanks a lot, hey guys. Kevin at GloveRelace.com, and here is the after shot of this Catcher's Mitt, the Wilson A2000 1791 Pro Stock Catcher's Mitt. As you can see, if you remember from the first part of this video, we went ahead and I had to replace the web as the old one was defective and I've darkened this piece to, to try and match the leather as, as close as possible. It's not a perfect match, but the holes did not line up so I did do a slight modification in the web. But uh, this glove is this glove's definitely good to go. Full relace and black lace, a couple coats of conditioner, gave it a good clean and uh, it's looking pretty good. Got its original, original shape back up. This will have to be broken in, but can be broken in pretty, pretty quickly. So, if you have any questions in regards to gloves and or glove relacing, feel free to contact me through my website at www.gloverelace.com. Thanks a lot, guys. Bye-bye.